The very first thing that hits you about Monument Valley is its amazing artwork. The game masterfully unifies elements of Escher-inspired monuments with cleverly designed illusory puzzles. Much like the Japanese paper-folding title Tengami, Monument Valley's shining light is not so much its gameplay, but the incredible scenic visuals and flawless presentation. The minimalistic, clean lines of Monument Valley removes any distractions from puzzle solving. The player is left to soak in the design and really appreciate the variety of dynamic 3D spatial arrangements on offer. From brightly coloured, joyous landscapes to the dark and melancholic, the environments that you play in are cleverly themed to deliver various emotions. The story surrounds Ida, a silent and misplaced princess, who you must guide through the monuments in order to collect various objects at the end of each map. By rearranging planes, twisting levers and rotating buildings, the architecture will transform before your eyes and open up previously inaccessible paths. Developer Us2 Games decided to set a balance in difficulty, allowing puzzles to seem impossible at first, but undoubtedly solvable as you experiment. Rarely did I come across a puzzle that gave me any sense of frustration, and each level was satisfying to complete. In fact, I'd go so far as to say the levels could have been even more of a challenge and still enjoyable. With an endless amount of puzzle arrangements being possible, it would have been nice to see a few advanced ones being thrown in. Despite this, the science behind each building was architected brilliantly, and it felt as though, in some weird way, it would be physically possible in reality. There's a cryptic underlying story being delivered with minute segments of dialogue, leaving the rest for the player to unfold and piece together. The payoff at the end of the game is worthy of any emotional investment you may have had, and it becomes evident why Monument Valley shines where some other puzzle games that lack substance falter. With only 10 levels to play in, Monument Valley is relatively short. Some of these are brief, while others last a little bit longer, taking Ida through various different structures. In total, the game can be completed in around about 90 minutes, and by this point you'll be yearning for more. Overall, Monument Valley hits every mark with astounding accuracy. It would be hard to argue a case against at least trying this one out. Sure, the experience doesn't last the longest, but every single moment of it is so sweet. Thank you for joining me for today's review of Monument Valley. If you enjoyed this review, go ahead and hit that subscribe button to stay up to date on the latest and best mobile games. This has been Alex for GameMob, that's www.gamemob.com.